Hello, everyone. Welcome back to uh, The Journey. Uh, my name is Diane Henry. Um, I'm here with my brother, Steve. Hey, Steve. Hey, what's happening, sister girl? Hey, um, and, um, and I'm on a journey to, um, to access the spirits inside. Um, most of us, you know, maybe all of us, um, who have not made that journey um, and, needs, and still need to make that journey, we um, need to have a guide, someone to show us how to do that. So that's why Steve's here. And um, thank you so much for joining us. And uh, take it away. Okay. And uh, hello, everyone. But here's the deal. You, you got to make the journey if you're stuck out in the world. Because the only sin is to be stuck out in the world. When I say stuck out in the world, you can easily tell. Everyone who brings something from inside, they got a window that lights up inside of you. Even after they're gone, whether it's St. Paul or Michael Jackson, whenever you hear of them, it lights up that spot inside of you because they left something from inside out. Now, you know, but most people have been misled because the sin is being outside of your own skin in the world. That's the only sin. When it, and, uh, and you've been taught that uh, the sin is the things out in the world. It is. As you being out there with them, nothing can change. Once something is put out in the earth from inside, it can't ever move. If you see eight turtledoves on a electric line in the middle of Iowa on April 20th, 1952, those dogs are going to always be right there. It can't move on April 20th, 1952. They can fly off, but it's not going to change what you've seen. Life go through making a print. It can't ever be redone. So once you come here, you'll give that first fruit. You try to get in, into it before you get 16 years old. The reason why I say 16, because if you suppose to brought the touchstone phone and you didn't bring it, the next generation which come behind you, they had to bring it because we're down here now to new phone. And you got to bring a phone, and like the numbers, you can't bring out the number that's already here. When they brought out, all of you, you got to bring out one, one step higher, right? Because nothing can move or change. And if you don't, and if you don't know it, because the devil is calling you outside of your own skin. Anyone calling you outside of your skin, it, it can't make sense to you that you're going to be able to do anything with it. Because everything that you can do, you got to do them on the inside. And when you reveal it to the world, it can never change. You can't reveal an alphabet if you don't complete them on the inside of you. In other words, somebody brought the alphabet in one generation. It was the next generation that exposed the vowels. Everything in creation is inside of you right now, just like the numbers are. But if you couldn't count, can you see any of them? <clears throat> but once you see them one time, can anyone change them? No. It ain't no learning thing. You don't ever learn anything. Because your eyes, they, there's not one thing that they ever seen in your whole life that's going to slip by them again. Do you know that? But the sounds that you hear in your ears, they ain't never going to be something that you heard before that's going to be new to you again. But if you're trying to regulate them, both what you're going to have. Yeah. No, they, they put to do a job. They'll do it if you let them. But if you let your ears take the place of your eyes, what you gonna have? Nothing. You letting somebody tell you. You letting somebody tell you what you see. How can anybody tell you what you see? How can they teach you what you do? I look kind of crazy teaching you what you do, wouldn't I? I can show you what I do. And when you find that spot light up inside of you, you adopt it. That's the purpose of the numbers. You didn't bring them to the world. Someone led you to it. You practiced from one to 300 one time. And one time, that's all it takes. If you don't know them, then you see all the numbers forever. 
But if you don't start from that one, go to that 300, you, you don't see none of it. If you think you will, like most people say, I bet you I would. Some of them claim they teach themselves to read, they teach themselves to do this and that. That being the case, you can pick up a Chinese book right now and you don't speak and you can read the, the manual. But you know that ain't gonna work right. Because you don't know what it's saying. But once they show you what it's saying, it's, you're just like them. All the things are yours. Everything in creation is yours. It's inside of you. Everything you find in there, the one directly. But the only thing you can get props for bringing into existence, it's got to be from inside of where. Can you go out and learn something that's going to be yours to bring into existence? You cannot learn nothing. New. It's impossible. How can you? You think you can learn something new? Oh, yes. Obviously, by you replicating, you saying, yeah. Well, they show you, but you shouldn't try to guess. Because the truth would be, no. Because you got to learn it from somewhere. How's it going to be new? It'd be new to you, but it won't be new to existence. The only way it can be yours has got to be new to existence. Right? Yeah. You can't mix nothing. I don't care what you mix together. Any two things that mix together, it's going to automatically make what? Something else or the same thing? Something else. If you mix uh, the A and the L, they say L, right? Yeah. There don't be A and L no more. But what when you put the L and the A? They don't be L either, do it? No. But every time something mixed together, it's going to do it every time, just like that, eh? Is there ever going to be any time it won't make something different? No. Okay, so any time two, any two things mix together, you put a little bit of yellow paint into a little bit of green paint. Is it going to be the same thing? So each of those? No. All oh, right, you put two J's side by side, is it going to be the same thing? No. Anytime, anytime two things mix together, it's going to create something totally different. You agree? When a man and a woman get together and have a baby, do it be the same thing? Or do it be something totally different? Something different. Yeah, every time two things mix together, it's going to be totally different. So when you see them reading that Bible off and all these things together, you know somebody kind of hoodwinked you, right? Because it can't, if, it's, if you can put two of them together, let's say Paul and Peter, those are two different characters, right? And from the other side of two different houses. You think you can use them? In the same sentence, you have to use the things that's already out in the world to build you a stepping stone pathway up through them. That's what the Bible tells you to do. The 12 stepping stones, you got to go away from your father's house and build your thing. The 12 stepping stones is your character. <clears throat> I'm going to kill you with graph one and graph two. But in this case, they're not kids. Most of the people that's reading that thing are done, they only are adults. But I put them graphs out there, but I know they don't quite understand them. I was saying when, when I get far enough down the road, I find someone and I'll explain them. Now, everybody out there, see, the house has got to be built from this inside of you. You got to, it's got to be built. See, the house of God is not built with hands, it's inside of you. I'm describing it to you. I'm describing it because I'm inside of me. I can see it. I can't help but look at the picture down there. I forgot about looking at the camera, but hey, you're getting a point. It, it, it's a point of conversation. Because you, you, you've you been taught that you got to learn things you don't. Once them eyes see it, them ears hear it, and it go through that line, it, 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 you got to learn how to leave that alone. Let them do their job. In other words, let me use it. You see, this voice you heard of mine, it's inside of you. Every time you see something that you didn't quite see before, the light gets brighter and brighter and brighter. And if it brightens all the way up, you ought to be able to see, right? Yeah. But if the light's getting brighter, you, you know, what you can do, you take time off. When you take the time off, the, 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 the light of the timeline of right now, it don't. Change its course at all. 
it's going to take another giant leap to front of it. So that light you had is going to dim a little bit because the main light got further away from it. You follow? Mm -hmm. But you don't have to receive nothing but one hand. Once you see it one time with your eyes, because it's inside of you, it's a window you can instantly go to, just like swimming. They have to walk you to it, but you can't go into one flat today and one flat Friday and one flat Wednesday. What it will do, it makes it harder for you that way. If you can kind of do it while it's opening up, then just open up your seat. Then you can do what you want better. But if you're trying to look for it, you won't never find nothing you're looking for because you put yourself in a pretty bad position because you can only look for what you already know. And you only can find something that you have no idea what it is. And the two, the two won't work together, you know, because anytime two things mix together, it's going to automatically, every time, make something else. Ain't never, not one point, you're going to put two things together and they still be the same two things. Anybody tell you otherwise, you know that that spirit of truth is you still right? You know, you have to worship God in spirit. <laughs> you know, that, that's the, the spirit of the Jesus the doctrine is all those 144,000 character doctrines. When you know that something has got to be that way, it's got to be that way, it can't exist. You know that, right? Because everything has to come from somewhere and it has to continue on the same journey. You can't just pop up and turn something the way you want it to be. Nobody can. It won't work that way. The alphabet is exactly where they are. Everybody find them. Whatever language, they can't move or take any away. What will happen if they do? Not a bird. It, it ain't going away. You can't get it wrong. How can you get it wrong? Is it possible to get the alphabet wrong? <laughs> I'm serious, because let's see if you don't know, I'll be able to show you. And if you do know, well, I know, so don't guess. <laughs> you know, because I'm showing you, you must have seen I mean, I, I, I put it this way. I, I, I apologize. I, I wasn't going to beat you up when I told you that. So you don't have to be scared no more. <laughs> Whatever, honey. You know, I, you, you know, you know I don't know nothing about no fighting. <laughs> I told you good because, you know, that's perfect. Because I'm just like you. You just stand there dead. <laughs> Okay, but, 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 but seriously though, uh, who was, uh, you were trying to guess or something. Uh, you, you said, know, you know, you said, you know, is, is it possible to get down the bedroom? And I said, right, you can't get them wrong. They can't move, they can't change. You just won't get them. Ain't no way you can get them wrong. Can't never move. You can't get the numbers wrong either. You just won't have them. You know, you, you only got to get them right or you can't get them right. Basically, yeah. <laughs> Basically, that's following the truth. You got to always follow the truth. Anything that you don't know in doctrine, how can you know it? It's impossible. So if you say you know it, you think you're able to move over to it? Everything is located inside of you in a window. If you already think you know where the window is, the window is dark, how are you going to find it? But if you don't know, it's, it's only when you get old, it's only that first. And if you can ever see the first thing, but the only first thing is going to be a long ways away because you, when you were young, you was trading through them every day. If you just don't stop being. But once they go to teaching you to pass, you know, your you window closed. I don't know what make people teach people to pass. They always be children that don't follow the path. You see them on TV changing the world because they didn't learn the past. They're working right now. You only can do something right now. When you see in the light of right now, you can't fit in with the people who's back in the past. Because you'd be out. Shit, I'm on the other side of everything, but 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 I know once I open the door over there, what's gonna happen on this side? Everybody gonna leave everybody out there. You know. But they've been warned, somebody won't open the door, they're going to show you. If you're trying to learn it, you ain't never going to find it. I'm putting it here. I'm not putting it here for the people out there. I'm going to show you only. And the people who've been following that Facebook page, they'll be able to show the people out there. 
but they'll be the one that have to join with you because you got to build the house of God. It's the thing is inside of you. But if you don't see it, what you gonna do? Take a close up behind you? So in other words, if you come in, what you do? Shut the door behind you. Yeah. But it, you got to leave your thing behind you. Your trail. So you leave your trail with the video. Anybody else? Fine. They got the tattoo in common. You use it to do something. That's the testimony you got to put in the same thing so others can see it. Because you got to work together here. Anyone who don't work together into this spot, that they scatter them into somewhere else, right? Anywhere else without being in the world. You know, and, 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 and how can you leave? Anytime you can't see it, it's like the numbers. If you can't see it, how do you know what 200 look like? Or three? You can't, can you? You know? <clears throat> you, see it inside. you do know the things are inside of you, everything that you, and the things are always going on. The music, all the music is playing all the time on the inside of you. You have to practice until you fall in the air. That's how when people can play, they can play in the air. But when people don't, they get on trying to learn what they heard, you can't get it that way. Everything is always happening on the inside. It's your dream. But once your window closed, you can't see it. So what you have to do is come in on the mind, or you won't get in. I mean, you don't need me lying to you. You know, uh, 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 other words, when I say mind, that means that when you come to this part of your body, the way you hear me here now, you can't bring none of that other bullshit over here. It ain't gonna come over here. You're just wasting your time. You cannot move not one word of Spanish into the English language window. You know that, right? They won't be found in two different places. You got to move away from one to go into the other. Well, you be trying to remember it. How you going to remember something? And it's constantly moving and growing. You can't. Because so it's like a whatever we talk, I got to talk about right now and now. I can't care what was there yesterday. But I can know where we stopped at. And I got to go back in it a little bit and go because. When I turned away from this, I left it right there. They ain't think no more about it until I came back. That's the way you got to do too, right? When you get into this, when you think about this, you, it's got to be this because it's got to grow. But when you try to put something else in it or wondering about that, how can, how can it lighten up? Because uh, being a hypocrite, that's why Christ is so bad. Uh, not the hypocrites, but that's the worst thing you can be. But you can't move if you've been a hypocrite. You know that, right? Okay. Right, because see, the hypocrite, you you gonna claim you got something that you you can't use. What kind of sense does that make? When you got something, you use it. You don't say I got this, I got that, right? Right. You say two plus two is four. Look, one two one two one two three four. You can use it. But when you can't use it, does that mean you got it or? You got something you can't use, you just call it the wrong thing, right? You're supposed to be calling it nothing instead of something. Correct? You can't argue with it. Okay. <laughs> On our Bible verse thing, you know, today we're going to, you need to do uh, John, the third, not John, Mark, the third chapter. The reason why, you can't, you can't, your Bible verse thing, to Diane, you can't add them to it. Now you have to, when you want to do something different, you shut all the things off. They don't mix. I'm showing you how to build a house that's on the inside. It ain't going to take nothing that you thought, it ain't going to be there. If it was there, I would have Because either if you follow it, I know what you're going to find. If you don't follow it, I know what you're going to miss. I mean, ain't nothing I can do right but Tell you the two plus two equal four. Now, if you think it equal nine, I mean, I, I still argue with you. Do I? <clears throat> you, you know, what he said, uh, 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 when that spirit comes, it, it, which is the spirit of truth, that's that, that, that graph we put in there. The spirit of truth is inside of you. What's the, you, you, each of those graphs, they're spirits. Once you see how it works, how it's going to change. 
Yeah, third chapter, Mark. I need to talk, we'll talk about them later. Everyone there, we already done them. Three. Okay. And he entered again into the synagogue. And there was a man there which had a withered hand. And they watched him, whether he would heal him on the Sabbath day, that they might accuse him. And he saith unto the man which had the withered hand, Stand forth. And he saith unto them, Is it lawful to do good on the Sabbath days, or to do evil, to save life, or to kill? But they held their peace. And when he had looked round about on them with anger, being grieved for the hardness of their hearts, he saith unto the man, Stretch forth thine hand. And he stretched it out, and his hand was restored whole as the other. And the Pharisees went forth, and straightway took counsel with the Herodians against him, how they might destroy him. But Jesus withdrew himself with his disciples to the sea, and a great multitude from Galilee followed him, and from Judea, and from Jerusalem, and from Idumea, and from beyond Jordan, and they about Tyre and Sidon, the great multitude, when they had heard what great things he did, came unto him. And he spake to his disciples that a small ship should wait on him because of the multitude, lest they should throng him. For he had healed many, and so much that they pressed upon him for to touch him as many as had plagues. And unclean spirits, when they saw him, fell down before him and cried, saying, Thou art the Son of God. And he straightly charged them that they should not make him known. And he goeth up into a mountain, and calleth unto him whom he would, and they came unto him. And he ordained twelve that they should be with him, and that he might send them forth to preach, and to have power to heal sicknesses, and to cast out devils. And Simon he surnamed Peter, and James the son of Zebedee, and John the brother of James, and he surnamed them Boanerges, which is the sons of thunder, and Andrew, and Philip, and Bartholomew, and Matthew, and Thomas, and James, the son of Alphaeus, and Thaddeus, and Simon the Canaanite, and Judas Iscariot, which also betrayed him. And they went into an house. And the multitude cometh together again, so that they could not so much as eat bread. And when his friends heard of it, they went out to lay hold on him, for they said, He is beside himself. The scribes which came down from Jerusalem said, He hath Beelzebub, and by the prince of the devils casteth he out devils. And he called him unto him, and said unto them in parables, How can Satan cast out Satan? And if a kingdom be divided against itself, that kingdom cannot stand. And if a house be divided against itself, that house cannot stand. And if Satan rise up against himself and be divided, he cannot stand but hath an end. No man can enter into a strong man's house and spoil his goods, except he will first bind the strong man, and then he will spoil his house. Verily I say unto you, all sin shall be forgiven unto the sons of men, and blasphemies wherewith soever they shall blaspheme. But he that shall blaspheme against the Holy Ghost hath never forgiveness, but is in danger of eternal damnation, because they said, He hath an unclean spirit. There came then his brethren and his mother, and standing without, sent unto him, calling him. And the multitude sat about him, and they said unto him, Behold, thy mother and thy brethren without seek for thee. And he answered them, saying, Who is my mother or my brethren? And 
he looked round about on them which sat about him and said, Behold, my mother and my brethren, for whosoever shall do the will of God, the same is my brother and my sister and mother. Okay, thank you. I appreciate it. And uh, we'll look forward to the next episode, the next uh, lesson real soon. All right, see you later. Bye.